Let's go take a look at this chest up here. Yeah. It's got a Pontiar, a delicate robe, and a small magical armor potion. Oh, a washboard. Yeah. Found that earlier. I was like, yeah, I'm gonna pass on that. Slow down arrowheads, huh? Yeah, well, you know. Explosive arrowheads. Fire arrowheads. I found a few things. Just go in here. Um, regular arrowheads. We'll have to see about how to imbue them with traits. All the food. Where's um? My phone's blowing up. Yeah, it is. All right. Um. Bleep bloop. Bleep bloop. I thought I saw another. Oh, there it is. Freezing arrowhead. With where those shafts go? There they are. No, I can tell you where to find a shaft. <laughs> I can I can choose shoot arrow, but I don't have a bow. <laughs> How does that work? Uh, okay, that's a good question. So, um, bear daughter should fight. I wonder if I can combine an arrowhead with a poison bottle. Oh, who figured something out? Nice. Now, does it use up the poison bottle altogether? Yes. Oh. Um. So does that mean that we have like fire essences or something? Um, I don't know. Okay, that's not valid. It makes me wonder what happens if you combine it with like an oil flask. I tried that. Nothing worked. It didn't work. Darn. Now but do you I have, have to combine the? Of do you combine the arrow or the arrowhead? The arrowhead. Okay, not the actual which arrow. Which actually, no. Which I think I screwed that up a minute ago. No. Yeah, you combine the arrowhead with it, with a po small poison flask, and it made the um thing. Okay. Now I found a cap. Now what is her helmet? Fifteen. Okay. Not better. Let me see what my phone was talking about. $308 Central Hudson. What? She said she got a bill from Central Hudson for $308. Like, where, where'd that come from? I don't know who Central Hudson is, but... Uh, electricity and gas if you're in the city electricity and if you're in the gas it's also uh, if you're in the city it's also gas gotcha they're like the power provider around here oh okay or con edison is the power central hudson would be like the utilities gotcha like the gas and whatnot so they told us that we weren't cut out for the outside world. I hear someone talking. Wolfram. Well, let's go say hi. He also has a basement. Like to play fetch with our femurs. Is that a mercy me? It walks, but it's not dead. I wasn't entirely certain I'd ever meet anyone anymore. Stop it, bear daughter. 
I'm not wearing a shirt. Yeah, you should get on that. The name's Wolfram, and it's a delight to make your acquaintance. Good to see, by the by, you don't belong to the Legion. Ten of their number accompanied me on a fact-finding mission to an ancient burial mound. But, as it turns out, they stood a snowflake's chance in hell against the undead. <laughs> Interesting. Not that I reckon my chance is any higher, though, especially with that vicious undead mutt prowling the grounds around this here ruin. I'd go so far as to say I'm in dire need of an armed escort back to the city, as a matter of fact. Oh, is that so? Well, how about you tell me more about yourself? I'm an archaeologist <laughs> and connoisseur of the undead. Because of my expertise... Consider this your interview, severe, friend. <laughs> of the Legion in your interview of employment. Investigate the ancient burial mound just outside of town. Whether we want Hoping you to employ to us or not. the source of the zombie plague. No such luck, though. So you know a lot about the undead. Quite so. I live for the dead, so to speak. The combination of archaeology and a case of incidental necromantic magic is what sparked my interest in the field. Of course, I'll be glad to share what knowledge I have obtained over the years. Oh, so we can ask him about zombies and skeletons. Yeah. Zombies are the results of vile necromancy in action. Among the resurrected dead, there are those who used to be wizards, and they can cast spells still. They slay their prey and bring them back as deathless thralls that fester with the diseases of decay. Mmm. Tasty. Should you encounter these menaces, always try to pick them off from afar. Don't let them get close, or they'll riddle you with the poisons and the blight that afflict them. Mm -hmm. That explains a lot about the zombies so far. Would have been nice to know earlier, guy. Thank you. Yeah, we already Anyone figured that out on our own, here, thanks. The ones around Sicil are the resurrected soldiers of Bracchus, the last and most infamous in the line of Sorcerer Kings. He himself is supposed to be buried somewhere around here, but no one knows Ooh. where the actual grave is. Long have I searched and deep have I dug, but so far I haven't found anything more spectacular than rusty weaponry and shards of pottery. Be that as it may, Bracchus' soldiers stalk these lands anew, and they still fight like veterans. I told those fools of legionnaires to bring maces instead of swords. You know, <laughs> weapons that crush these skeleton bones, not blades that may ricochet right off. Hell, even a sturdy branch would do the job better. But they didn't listen, and now they're dead. So what you're telling me is I should be dual-wielding maces right now. Oh, or sticks. Or sticks. Use an unusual amount of magic against you. These soldiers were loyal to a sorcerer king, after all. Dark magic all around. So let's explore the basement and then escort him. I'll never make okay. it back to Sicil alone. But you've gotten this far. You can bring me back, can't you? I'm, I'm gonna check out this other room first. Oh. Um. Uh, I guess we can't just leave and come back. We have to do it now. Oh, uh, <laughs> we can do it now. That's fine. We certainly can. Let's be off. Indeed. Don't you worry. We'll keep you safe. Marvelous. Mighty fine of you. Lead the way, I say. He'll just have to follow us around. Sucks for him. All right. Let's go downstairs. Well, I mean, I was going to check the other room out first. Oh, there's nothing in there. Okay, I'm coming down. There's a lot of mushrooms and stuff down here. Mushrooms are nice for potions. And there's poison cheese, if you wanted any. No, I'm good, thanks. What happened to my chest piece, anyway? I don't know. I got an unidentified poignard and aged leather bracers. Let's see what her bracers are. Somehow I de-equipped it, I guess. Um. The log was updated? When's our last reload save? A long time ago, why? Because Wolfram just ran off and died. He didn't let us uh. lead the way, he just left. We were at the lighthouse. 
Well, screw him. Yeah, he's dead. Oh well. What was that? I have something I wanted to send to, um... What's your face? Where is it? Where is it? Here we go. Alright, uh, send to Bear Daughter. Four new messages. I'm popular. Was it any good? Uh, not really. You want to sell it? Uh, no, it's fine. I'm trying to pretend to be able to text. Um. Um. So where did Wolfram die? I don't know. I didn't think that he was just gonna run off. Yeah, it, it didn't look like he did when you went down. Sodden all the way to my boot soles. Oh, look at that sick looking dog. Oh, and he wants to fight. She just run up to him and he's like, hey, fight time. No, he wants to fight all these things. Oh. Well, apparently oh, I just got myself in, in trouble. Let me see what this says. No. New log entry added. Twin dungeons. We discovered a strange set of burial mounds outside Cecil. Cecil. I can attack the dog, I don't know. I think he's going after them though, isn't he? I don't know, we'll find out. I'm gonna delay my turn and see. Eventually we'll find that dude. Oh, I found his body. Yeah, where is it? It's to the south. It's uh, south of that roofed area near some uh, hay bales, I think. Were you just looking around? Yeah, I was looking for his body. He's near some like rocks near the hay bales in a tree. I want to uh, see what this dog does. Oh, yeah, yep. he just attacked me. You traitorous little bugger. Be well, because when we came into the area, some of one of our characters said something about the dog looks like it wants to play fetch with our femur, so I wasn't sure. Yeah, that's a good point. Holy crap, there's like fire over here. What is he just doing? He just summoned a zombie boar. Oh, that's nice. And you're frozen, aren't you? Yeah, it looks like it. Great. Honestly, I didn't mean to run in here. I kind <laughs> of uh, thought I was invisible, and I wasn't. Oh. All right, well, I'm gonna deal with this boar. I guess. He's poisoned now? Yeah, he's what? a zombie. He excretes poison, and he'll explode oh. into poison. Yeah, and he heals from poison clouds. What is that? You have lowered armor for three turns? Uh, I have lowered armor for three turns. Oh, because you got hit with a silver arrow. Bullcrap. Take that, boar. Can you do it again? No, I don't have enough points. Take it, boar. Oh, he's gonna pop. He's gonna pop. No? Alright. Anything you can do. <laughs> Meow. Thank you. I think I hurt myself on that one. Yeah, you're poisoned now. Eh, it happens. I keep getting pushed all the way back. Should I shoot another fire arrow on them, or should I do ricochet? Um, 
I had ricochet. All right, that was pretty good. <laughs> I'll give you that one. <laughs> Careful of the poison in front of her. Yeah. See if maybe you can sidestep it a little bit and then charge. Straight into that undead swordsman at the back. Yeah, maybe I can make it. If I can get over here. Uh. If I could just the right. There you go. That was like nearly pixel perfect. <laughs> like it kept popping off of them. Well, this is you, my friend. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Um, who are you going to go? Oh, you're frozen for two more turns. Balls. Yeah. About that. What's that other thing on me? Flanked. Oh, defense rating reduced. So they're going to hurt me a lot. Whoa. Probably should have done that on the two guys behind me. And you. <laughs> Uh, I'm not going to throw that. What was it? Uh, I have a tremor grenade, but I'm not going to throw it because it's going to blow up and hurt all of us, and that's not, not really the plan. No. All right, well, as soon as Bear Daughter's turn comes up, I'm going to shoot a fire arrow at those guys. Surprise, Bear Daughter's turn. Oh, I need to heal. Nice. Thank you. Time for some of that whirlwind action. Um, how much does that cost? Four? Oh yeah, that's definitely better. Four, one attack is four. That's definitely better. Seven power mad lows. Ah. And that's what I call game. Oh, we got a dog and a caster to deal with. I am free. I gotta heal up. You gotta watch your health. If you can sap the dog or something. Yeah. Yeah, but now I'm also low on... Uh... Ooh, that cloud is on you, I think. Looks like. Mm, maybe not. Low on what? Uh, AP. I can't do anything else. Oh. So if you can kill that dog, I have Bear Daughter trying to run up to maybe. Well, he's down for a turn or two, two. So. Okay. God damn it. <laughs> You tried. Did not go where I intended. You were aiming over toward the uh, door, weren't you? Yeah. I was aiming near the spires over there. Get her out of there, and it'll kill him. Yeah, I'm, I'm hoping. Think she'll have enough range to go and hit him? She still has crushing fist. Oh. Okay. Um, it just sucks that she can't pat out herself. She can't put herself out from the fire. You have that ability? She has an ability to put a friendly unit, uh, put a fire out on a friendly unit, but not on herself. Interesting. Um, it's help a knockdown ally back up or part pat out a burning one. There's a regen scroll over there. Good tales, my friend. Killing my looting chances, woman. <laughs> Ooh, a firestorm grenade. This guy's taking everything. Look, they don't call it ninja looting for nothing. Alright, the dude's body's over here. We should we yeah, we should probably not, because Lockpicks. 
Where is this body? It's south of here. Oh, yeah, there it is. Oh! Yeah, I figured that would happen, because, you know, something had to kill him. <laughs> so. Um, it is one skeleton. Oh, that's it? Just run toward him. I'm, uh, texting. Oh, okay. It's a time of much frustration that I am working diligently uh, to not uh, succumb to. Ah. Uh, you need not say more, my friend. I can read between the lines. Kind of. It's not. It's not a. It's not a monthly sort of deal. It's just a straight up bullcrap. <laughs> yeah, no. Stuff, stuff's going down, and she's frustrated, and you're just there to be vented to. Be be vented. At I. At to be, be blamed. I don't know. Oh, blamed. Um. Okay. Yeah. All right. This is what four. This is four. Yeah. Immune to knockdown. Maybe because he's already stunned. Oh, maybe. Um, if my heal comes up while we're in battle, I'll hit you with it. Oh, I'm sure I'll be fine. Eh, just anyway. Might as well have her pass her turn at this point. Or delay it. Well, I'll come in for three points and save four of them. Oh yeah, might as well. Eternal silence awaits you. Gold and a fire arrowhead. Where's that fire arrowhead? I s saw it. Loot. Are you gonna give it to me anyway? <laughs> I know. It's the principle of the matter, though. Indeed. Um. What an idiot. All right, where's that fire arrowhead? Fire. Something just happened. And I feel like I took damage. No, you're fine. Don't worry. <clears throat> that is. I would have healed you if you asked. Hey, could you heal me? Uh, it's a little late now. Now I need it. And it's on cooldown anyway. You don't. I clearly need it more. I'm missing like 20 more health than you. How much health are you missing? I'm 155 out of 226. Huh. You have more health than me. Yes, I do. So you're the tank, right? No, that's not how this goes. <laughs> oh, is it? Because you're up there getting all the loot. <laughs> so, you know. Look, I'm a shadow blade for a reason. <laughs> Ooh, there's a chest up there in that fiery area. Uh, so there are tombs down here. My kingdom for a dry shot. Uh, what? what? Oh, you going? went in there? Yeah. Are we going in there again? What fiery area? Uh, to the north of here. Should I save? Yes, you should save. Okay. Are we going in or going up? Uh, let's go up. See okay. if we can get any. Careful, because there's probably going to be enemies up there, because it's all... Um, there are level oh. four lesser fire elementals. Interesting. And, and there's a trap an door. undead pyromancer. Hmm. Que curioso. Let's see. I have a rain scroll spell. That I could probably cast on them. I would imagine that would weaken them, would not. I also have a frost grenade Maybe. that I can go toss at them. That's a good idea. Hmm. I don't know. Shall we engage? Um. Uh, let me save again. Might want to heal Say yourself. Yeah.
All right, we are saved. Praise so. Jesus. <laughs> I I had a feeling something <laughs> like that was coming. Praise the sun. Oh hey, Stardust Herb. So there's three of them. Plus the pyromancer. Uh, so. Pyromancer. So I can try and take Bear Daughter and set her in the back corner here where the Guapinha mushrooms are. Okay. They have quite the uh, visual spectrum there. That they do. close. <laughs> Where are you? Oh, you're a bush and a rock. Yeah, I'm just hanging out here at the moment. I could go invisible and try and get myself up behind them. Level four. What are we? We're all level four. Yeah. Um. You could try, and I can slowly pull up alongside. I guess. Well, the thing is, invisibility outside of com. Well, I don't know if it'll engage in combat if I go invisible and walk up there. It might. I don't think you will be in combat until they notice you. Okay. Uh, well, we're in combat, so... Well, you're in combat. You look, but you ah, see. yes. Oh, and my sneaking failed. Apparently. So, now I'm in combat as well. Well, that did 12 whole damage and failed the freeze. Oh, come on! <laughs> I was just getting ready to attack with her, too. Well, they, uh, get hurt pretty easily. Oh, apparently that did nothing. Did you miss, or...? No, I hit them on the ground, and it just froze the ground. Bear Daughter created ice when using ice on fire. <laughs> so maybe it'll make them slip. Maybe they'll have to resist the uh, possibility of slipping. Knockdown failed. Well, they are and elementals. Yeah. That that knocked him down though. Yeah, that knocked him out. Why are you just walking over him? I'm not. I'm not. What it, what 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 is going on right now? I killed him. What happened? You no, he's knocked down, but you just started walking. Yeah, I got like out of combat. Oh, well, that was weird. Well, you are very much hurt, my friend. Yeah, because I was in. I got into the fire and it just started. Lighten me up because I wasn't in combat. It's bullcrap. Like that was so unexpected. Please do something to heal yourself. I. Uh, you already used the skill in combat. What? Pop, pop a potion. Yeah, I'm gonna pop a couple. Apparently, I'm just done for there. I don't know what it knocked me out of combat. That was so weird. Like, did I knock him unconscious so I had nobody that knew I was there? I don't like that. That I feel like that made that made me waste stuff. I'm with you. It's nice that you blew that guy apart, though. That was pretty cool. Yeah, and that pyromancer's frozen now. This thing's dead. So that's what ice does. If you step on it, you have a chance of being frozen.
That's good to know. Attack of the arrow surge. No. Tank attacks. <laughs> so I tried to go behind him to uh, stab him in the back, and my guy moved instead. So you have to be really careful with your uh, movement, like, with your decisions. Once something happens, wait a moment, and then do it again. Yeah. Found that out the hard way. Oh, crap. Duggets might die. Can you crush him from there? I'm gonna try. You can, good. That's right, I got the Pyromancer. Oh, shield's not gonna help you any, buddy. Watch all the ice back there. <laughs> Called it. I was trying to see if I could come and help you. <laughs> Dude just slips and prat falls. Oh, uh, gosh darn. <laughs> I hate my life. Oh, wow, that's so much she's going to... She's in... Is she... Okay, she is in combat. She just took a ton of damage, and she's going to die next turn. Well, hope you're ready to resurrect her. Bless the seven. I am restored. I am restored. The seven, call me home. Still down over here. Okay, guys, I'm, I'm fine. Hey, look, a chest. Is there anything good in there? Frost grenade, um, aged leather bracers, and a cloth cap. Wow. So worth. What's half of 90? 45. Why did I even bother asking? I knew that. <laughs> I can go pick some mushrooms, though. Very carefully. Ooh, steel bar. <laughs> and there. Sent you some stuff that you're able to sell. Uh, thank you. You're welcome. Very careful with your movement here. Yeah. There is still this trap door. Oh, right. Oh. And you just let her on fire. Apparently. We're almost leveled again, though. This is much better than just doing quests. Jeez. Yeah. Why couldn't we just go searching for fights to begin with? <laughs> that movement was questionable, Medora. <laughs> I look like an assassin. Medora looks retarded. Yeah. Did you hear yourself? No, I, I hit her with a regen scroll. A <sighs> Thanks. <laughs> you knew what you were signing up for when you <laughs> when you did this, right? 
I mean, I didn't know somebody else was gonna, you know, be running a vampirism <laughs> trade. <laughs> oh, my friend. All right, I gotta wait on a lengthy cooldown. Why don't you give her some dinner? That's a good idea. Take her out wine and diner, you know. Yeah. Because it heals 15% and gives her plus one strength. Let's see, where is my dinner? Split. That was the wrong person. I sent them to Bear Daughter instead of Medora. Yeah, I'll send them back. <coughs> there you go, they're in Medora's. Alrighty. Thank you, sir. Not a problem, friend. As good as a new penny. As good as a new penny. Is that so? Tomato sauce heals five percent. Poison resistance plus ten percent. All right. Uh, let me save that terrible, terrible battle. <laughs> I don't know. I think it went pretty well. I don't know that having to burn two pots in that um. Which reminds me, I should make more pots. Having to burn two pots because of that weird fire fiasco. Yeah. I can only make one more. Well, I guess it's better than nothing. Oh, you're already in. Yes. 